another episode of Ryan's cooking. Today I will be cooking jackfruit seed with beef. Everybody knows in Bangladesh this is a very delicacy food and everybody loves it. Jackfruit is the national fruit of Bangladesh. So now I will be showing you how to cook jackfruit with beef. The ingredients that I'll be using today for making the jackfruit and beef bhuna, I have beef half kilo I have jackfruit, seeds, then I have onion, garlic and ginger paste. I have all the spices over here, cumin, cardamom, then red chili powder, turmeric, all of them. And here I have all the spices, the cardamom stick, clove, then jeera, you have bay leaf, you have maize, you have uh, the black cardamom, black pepper and some other stuff. You have tomato and chili. Now I will go to the cooking process. My pan is hot. I put a half cup of oil. It's soybean oil. Now I'll be taking the dry stuff. These are all the garam masala and I'll fry it for one minute. It has to be fried for one minute. Here viewers, I live in the Philippines. So I got jackfruit in the wet market. I took the jackfruit seed and I cleaned it and I had to clean, keep it soaked in the water for two to three hours and then I cleaned it and you get the finished product like this. I took beef and made it into small cubes like this. My spices are cooked for one to two minutes. Now I'll be putting the onion, garlic and ginger paste. You need to cook the onion, garlic and ginger paste for four to five minutes. My onion, garlic and ginger is cooked for four to five minutes. Now I'm taking a teaspoon of salt. You may take your salt according to your taste. I'm taking one and a half teaspoon of salt. After the salt, I'll be putting the dry ingredients, the dry masala and mix it. While mixing it, you need to put the tomatoes and the green chili. And then again cook it for 5 minutes so that you can uh, get the smell or the aroma of the spices. My spice has been cooked properly. Everything is cooked properly. Can you see the color? Look at the color, how red it is. It's actually for the Kashmiri red chili powder. So now I will be putting the beef in the spices. I put the beef in the spices and I'll cook it for 20 to 30 minutes. It has to boil properly. I will not put any water for the first 10 minutes. I will let it just boil in its heat or in its spice now. The beef is already halfway cooked. Can you see the color, how red it is? So after a few more minutes, around after five to 10 minutes, I will put the jackfruit seed and then let it boil for 20 minutes. Now I'm opening the lid. The beef is still hard. So I put some extra water, some hot water, and I kept it actually for 30 minutes. Now the beef is a little softer, so I will put the jackfruit seed. I'm putting the jackfruit seed now, and I will cook it for 20 to 25 minutes so that the jackfruit seed gets softer, also the meat gets softer. So I'll be back after 20 to 25 minutes. My cooking is done, so I open the lid and there you go, it's done and the gravy is gone down, the gravy is dry already. But before taking it down, 
I'm just taking a pinch of cinnamon and coriander and just putting it on it. Now I will serve it in a bowl and I will show you the finished product. There you go, the finished product of my cooking. The beef and the jackfruit or kathale bichi with gorur mangsho, what you call in Bangladesh. You can have it with the spicy pickle or the spicy paste made by my friend Jules. So enjoy having it, the easy way of cooking kathale bichi with beef or jackfruit cooking with beef. See you next time in another video.